back to my kitchen. Recently, my husband came back from work and he was raving about something Spanish. So I asked him. He did not tell me. Hmm, I thought to myself, is it a Spanish girl? But much to my disappointment, it was just a yummy Spanish cookie he had. These pretty Spanish cookies are called panelets. In Spain, these are specially made for All Saints Festival. Today I'm going to make these Spanish cookies for the very first time. And for this, I'm going to use my new toy. Ta-da! It's a very simple recipe. All we need is almond flour, sugar, one egg, pine nuts, and pistachio. So the almond powder will go in, sugar, and mix it slowly. To this, I'm going to add my egg. So here's the dough. As you can see, it's sticky. You're supposed to chill it overnight, but I'm going to chill it for an hour. Let's wrap it. And chill this dough for an hour. While my dough is resting, I'm going to prepare the rest of the stuff. Here, here are pistachios, which I'm going to grind them coarsely. For next step, I took one egg and I whipped it and I'm going to put half in this bowl and half in that bowl. To this mixture, I'm going to add the pine nuts. This one gets pistachios. For next step, I got the chill dough out, rolled it, rolled it into two, two long snakes and then I'm going to cut this big size. Make a ball out of it, small ball, and then I'm going to roll it in pine nut mixture. I'm going to coat it with pine nuts. So these are my pine nut cookie balls. The, these are pistachio cookie balls, and I had some leftover. I ran out of nuts, so I put chocolate chips in them. And these three have coffee in them. So I am going to brush my chocolate and coffee cookie with a little bit of egg wash, the leftover egg. And I have heated my oven to 500. It's on broiler and I'm going to zap them for five minutes, that's it. The cooking time is five minutes. So there you go. Hot oven, screaming hot oven. So here's my final product, my yummy Spanish panelets. As you can see, the pine nuts are browned, pistachios are toasted, and oh, the coffee flavor. I just love it, the burnt coffee flavor. So thank you for watching my videos and for all my recipes and the ingredients, please go to shebasrecipes.com. Thank you. See you next time. Bye.